a very warm and refreshing good morning to you, me and all who are present here. First of all, I would like to pay my honor to my honorable caller who gave me this wonderful opportunity to present myself in front of you. His name is Mr. Manoj sir. Thank you so much sir. I am Arish from class 12th and I have recently passed my 11th standard from Narana Public School which is situated in Gautam Budhnagar district. But right now I am passing in 12th standard in Narana Public School. Regarding my personality traits, I am amicable, honest and a theist person. As far as my qualifications are concerned, so I have recently passed my 11th standard and right now I am pursuing in 12th standard. Regarding my personality traits, I am amicable, theist and an honest person. Now I am going to tell you something about my topic which is hemoglobin. So hemoglobin is a red color pigment which is present in blood. It is present in RBCs, also known as oxygen carrier. It carries oxygen from one part to another part of the body. Hemoglobin consists the two parts, first is hema part and second is globin part. Hema part is a iron part and globin part is a protein. Globin, one globin part consists four iron and four molecules of oxygen. One oxygen hemoglobin forms four molecules of oxygenated hemoglobin. Now, what are the conditions over the association of hemoglobin? So, association is of hemoglobin, first of all, high pH value of O2 and low pH value of CO2, low temperature and less pH means more H plus ions and the conditions over the dissociation of hemoglobin. Conditions of dissociation of hemoglobin are first condition is that low high temperature and low high pH value means H plus ions are less and Low, low power pressure of O2 and high power pressure of CO2. Thank you so much for listening to me. Have a nice day. Thanks again.